why he plays mind games. Hello, my name is Chengi of Chengi's World. I am, of course, like I said, Chengi and you, 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 my precious one, are my world. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and comment if you're part of this amazing tribe of women that I adore. Okay, and my job here today is to teach you how to present, how to show up in the world as a high value, high status, high worth woman that men find completely irresistible. If you're up for that, put your hand up and say yes in the comment section because that's what we're going to be doing today. So why does he play mind games? It's very simple, ladies. People in general play, who play mind games are people who don't have substance, okay? They don't have grounding, they're insecure, they are looking for validation, they don't understand a world that, that they cannot control. They're either, um, you know, in this, they're either very, very insecure. So your man, if he's playing mind games with you, you don't, he, he, he messes with your mind, you don't quite know whether you're coming or whether you're going. Maybe you can tell me some of the mind games that men have played on you in the comment section because I'd love to hear that and maybe continue this conversation on my Facebook group. So if you're not in my Facebook group, go to Chengi's Angels and on that group we discuss issues, more listening to each other, helping each other, sharing with each other these issues. So if you have any if you have had anybody play mind games, please tell me what those mind games are right below. Mind games like, uh, you know, saying one thing but meaning another, uh, making you feel uh, insecure in one way, shape or form. So that number one is insecurity on his part. He's insecure and so he is seeking to put you and destabilize you because he's insecure and he wants you insecure because he understands that if you're insecure, he can maneuver and manipulate. The other reason is it is a narcissist. Narcissists enjoy playing with people's minds. It's like a game for them or if they're sociopaths. It's so that you constantly put all the attention on them, give them the love, give them the cherishing, giving them the respect and then having to give you nothing because you are not worthy or you are not very smart. So that is the second reason that somebody would play games on with you. The other reason that somebody would play games on you is a fear of losing you. They're afraid that if they let you realize how amazing and how wonderful you are, you will choose not to be with them. You will opt out of that relationship with them. And if somebody is afraid, then they will try and use games in order to control. Again, it's the same principle as control, right? Now, what do you do when somebody's playing mind games? The first thing that you do is call them out on it. This is what I believe you're trying to do. It's not going to work and it's going to make me lose you. You're going to lose me as a result of it. Now, you have to think about what is costing your self-esteem, what is costing your self-worth, what is costing all, all of those things because those things are your dating currency. They're your relationship currency. If you allow allowing somebody to deplete your self-esteem to, to cause you to lack confidence is like allowing somebody to have the pin to your bank account so they can withdraw money whenever they like. You have to put a stop to mind games. And if that person does not respect your feelings regarding them stopping playing these games, then you need to leave the relationship. It's that simple. You cannot afford to be somebody who makes you feel unsure, uncertain, I, you're not here, you're not there, and they're doing it purposely. You know it's purposeful because you're watching this video and you're thinking, yeah, he plays those games, okay? That person, if you're dating them, is not serious, they're not trying to keep you, they're here to play, and they want to manipulate that situation, or they're going to be a very toxic relationship for you. So those are the reasons why you should absolutely not engage in, some, in a relationship with somebody who plays mind games. I certainly hope that was helpful. Make sure you download my free guide that I've been working on forever and all for free for you, my beautiful people, that you will download it. And when you do that, you will be able to um, get access to that information and really begin to work on how to become high value, high status, high worth in every way, shape or form. So thank you so much for watching. It's so good to see you again. I'll see you in my next video. In the meantime, take care of you. Bye-bye now.